It's 95 degrees out here every day and this is our office. On one of the hottest days of the year, Alan Milligan and his crew of land managers with the Southwest Florida Water Management District are working hard now to prepare for next year's fire season by prescribed burning hundreds of acres in the Starkey Wilderness Preserve in Pasco County. It's a, a tremendous asset. It's fundamentally one of our best tools to limit and prevent wildfires. But with prescribed fire, we can reduce the amount of fuels that are available and we can get what we call black, which is secure zones out on the property where a naturally ignited wildfire would run into and, and calm way down and we can get ahead of it. Which is exactly what happened in last spring's wildfire in the preserve, where district staff and the Florida Forest Service worked side by side, battling the blaze. The flames were laying over so far, like, you know, a quarter of a mile ahead of it, that even the Blackhawk was having trouble dumping water on that fire because they couldn't see the, the terrain. They couldn't see the earth for the flames and the smoke. Judith Tier with the Florida Forest Service says it was a district prescribed burn six months earlier that helped keep the fire from potentially spreading into a neighborhood. It is a classic example of how well that works. We are so thankful for our relationship with Swift Mud. It gives us a lot of pride and we take a lot of pride in the things that we're able to do and there's a lot of other benefits that we create. There's the wildlife benefits and the water resource benefits. Milligan says burning off decaying organics on the ground means cleaner water absorbing faster into the aquifer. It's essentially cleaning the filter, promoting good clean surface water and, and one of the biggest things that happens is uh, infiltration. There's a lot of water filtered into the surficial aquifer from these lands and these lands provide that resource to the public. Long hot days managing thousands of acres of conservation lands. For Milligan, it's the work he loves. You get to the end of the day and everybody can go home and we can be safe and happy and proud of what we've done that day.